Jesus Freak here. And I get to think, I've sometimes had people say, you know, when you, uh, when someone's like, I love you, and you're always like, you know, I know, or whatever, and I don't really, you know, say I love them or whatever. But it's probably weird. I just, you know, I tend to feel that, you know, constantly saying that, you know, I love you, I love you. You could say it a million times, and it's hollow as a drinking straw. But I prefer to say it by doing it. It means more, I think. Than if you just say it without... We have the saying, you know, actions speak louder than words. And well, you're going to say, hold up, wait. That's not in the Bible. Not in so many words it isn't. But you got in Matthew 21, 28 through 31. He'll say, you know, oh, he has this parable where he talks about the guy with two sons. and He asks him, he asks the older one, he asks him to go out and do some work in the field for him. And he says, sure. And just sits on his butt. He goes to the other kid and says, As, can you go do, out, do some work in the field for me today? And I think I'll pass. But he goes out and does it. And says, who is doing what his father asked? And the moral you're supposed to take away from that is actions speak louder than words. And I know it comes across a bit odd that I spare on the words. Maybe the fact that I'm autistic, it makes a little more sense. But I always feel, you know, words are waste. They don't mean anything in and of themselves. It's what you do that matters. More than what you say. And I've tried to bear my life according to that. Which I know I ain't perfect. I'm a human being. Of course I'm not perfect. But that's just how I've always tried to be. Jesus freak out.